This video was made possible by Squarespace. Build your website for 10% off at squarespace.com forward slash Nick Zamelli. Well, it's certainly a colourful thing to turn and it can get pretty messy. Hey folks, welcome back to my channel. Hopefully, everyone's having a happy day. Hey. Today, we are going to be making a project with these. <laughs> I picked up some more old skateboards. Although these are actually new skateboards, but you can buy them quite cheap over here. Um, so, uh, I've seen a few people make some stuff from skateboards. As you know, I've made one project with skateboards. But I thought to myself that I wanted to make something a little bit nicer than the last project I made. The last project I made was for Halloween. It was pretty scary. It wasn't scary. But today, I'm thinking of something kind of like, maybe a bowl or a vase of some kind. I think that would look really cool. You may have seen one already, I know. But you haven't seen one from me. Hey, handsome. So I put a couple of uh, clamps <laughs> on uh, this project. I didn't use the big ones initially and I was kind of like putting them all on and I noticed that I was kind of like covering the whole camera up so you wouldn't be able to see anything anyway. Anyway, I've decided to do this in two batches because in an ideal world, what would have been ideal, but it's not because we don't have that many boards, is to have made something out of like the middle section uh, and we need a bigger blank than that, twice as big as that really. Um, and you can make something like, you know, bring it out to here with that kind of shape. And then another uh, project using the ends of the, the, the board. But we don't have enough ends because I didn't buy enough boards. Basically what I'm trying to say is <laughs> If I'd had enough boards, it would have been better for me to, you know, cut more of the ends off and have this blank out here and then make something from that and then do this one another day. But we don't. So what I'm going to try to have to do is try to use this blank and that blank together somehow. Um, when I tried to glue them both together, it was just not happening. There's big gaps and everything. So I need to rethink how we're going to do that. But initially what we're going to do is we're going to leave this glued up leave that one glued up overnight uh, hopefully the clamps <laughs> will, will do it do their job um, and then we'll figure out how we do it you may just have to sort of put this through the bandsaw straighten it up and then glue it to that one possibly anyway I shall start waffling and let it dry up
Well, it's certainly a colourful thing to turn and it can get pretty messy. Oh yeah, baby. Look at this. This is coming up really cool. Hey, I like this. Okay, all right. Well, what I'm gonna do now is gonna put a bit of the old uh, sanding cedar on this from Chestnut Products. Wherever that badger is. Where is it? Somewhere around here somewhere. Look at this stuff. I'm probably gonna save some of this because that's pretty cool, isn't it? Look at that. I reckon I'll definitely need to save some of that. Yeah, could make something really funky with that. Well, I just put a bit of this on, look at this, pop out. That is nice, it's gonna look really lovely actually. I haven't done anything kind of like this before with this wood. I've made a little silly, <laughs> um, uh, what was it, a Halloween thing I made. That was a little bit rubbish from it. Look at that. Yes, this is gonna look wicked. Right, up next. Oh yeah, baby. So what do you reckon that looks like? Now for a bit of sanding. Look at this stuff. We are gonna save some of this. Got myself a badger bag. And we're gonna keep some of this for a rainy day. Nice. Look forward to using this.
Notice anything different? Yep, I'm in my new shop. Happy days! Finally managed to get in my new shop, which is pretty cool. I'm not really too sure how uh, it's going to end up sounding in here or looking, um, but obviously it sounds to me a little bit echoey at the moment. That's probably because I haven't got a lot in this room. It is a fairly big room compared to the room I had before. Anyway, I'm supposed to be showing you this, <laughs> but it just so happens that the ending um, of this video, I did the beginning part of this video um, at my old shop uh, and ended up finishing it. Um, I finished it at my old shop, but I'm doing the outro, as we would call it, in my new shop. So there we go, guys. Uh, take a look at that. Um, again, I'm not too sure about the lighting in here at the moment. I've got to kind of try and fix this. Now, that's a bit too bright. I've got this light over here and it's it's actually really quite bright. Um, but it, otherwise, without that, it's a bit too dark, I think. Um, again, I'm hoping that the sound quality is coming through okay. Um, it does sound a bit echoey, so if it does sound like that to you guys, then apologise, I will get it fixed or sorted somehow. But anyway, back to this project. Um, there we go. Not bad, actually. I'm fairly pleased with the outcome. Um, as you know, we didn't glue all of those together. Got my little emblem in there as well. This is 006. Um, and um, yeah, I mean, it's different. <laughs> That I can say, and it's weird. But we like weird, as you know. Um, and I don't know, it's kind of a half sort of bowl. You know, you can obviously, <laughs> I don't know, you could put fruit in it maybe or something, I don't know. But I kind of just wanted to do this uh, skateboard thing because I did one project, oh, it's up here. I did this project <laughs> a little while ago with skateboards. And uh, yeah. So there it is. I hope that you enjoyed watching this thing <laughs> being turned. The next project that I've got for you guys, I did start in my old shop and I will be finishing it in my new shop. So uh, yeah, I'm pretty much up and running now. Um, I've sort of set up all my kind of memorabilia and bits and pieces, memorabilia, bits and pieces, stickers, stuff that have been sent to me and I've got my bigger sticker board up. Happy days, which is what we wanted in the first place. So uh, my sticker board kind of extends now over here and all the way over here. So I've started, as you see, putting some more stickers up. So if you sent me a sticker, you might see your sticker up here. If not, then I'm still in the process of putting stickers up and finding them and digging them out of you know places where I stored them. But as you can see, these are all new ones. Grass makes, Jackman works, Shop Time. Uh, prickly sauce, craft of Helen, Rob's workshop, make everything, PC, WWPC, PCWW. Um, and over this side, we got Evelyn Caitlin, Jordan Woodworks, Trend, Bobby Duke, um, I like to make stuff, Boeing, there's many other ones up there. And there's tons more as well that I've got uh, to put up, so I will be putting a few of those up there. Try to get everything up in here that kind of was relevant so that you guys could obviously see it. Yes, Back to the Future. <laughs> Gotta have that playing because that is my favorite, all time favorite film. Um, and obviously all the bits and pieces that I've made and people have sent me and stuff. Uh, Heath Knuckles is in the house. Not forgetting my trumpet. <laughs> We've got some other bits down here. Uh, we've got our little trolls from YouTube. Say hello to the trolls. And a few other bits and pieces. My hat's up here. I don't know if you can see right at the top there or not, but uh, there's all sorts of other bits and pieces going on uh, everywhere. So <laughs> I wanted to try and incorporate uh, everything I could in this section. Um, you can't really see over there, but um, over there you can see you've got to make a central sign. Um, we've got some lights and bits and pieces that I made. There's a light there I made out of a screwdriver. Have you seen that? I don't know if you've seen that. You probably can't see it. But I'll show that to you another day. It's out of one of those really old screwdriver things. Oh, 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 oh. Now that wasn't good. Um, there we go. Hang on, let me show you post. There. <laughs> it's just one of those screwdriver, old, really old screwdrivers. And yeah, made it into a lamp. 
I've just destroyed half my shop. I've destroyed half my shop then. Uh, so there we go, yeah, bits and pieces. My mask of Zorro. But again, I, I need to fix the lighting, I think. I don't know, maybe you guys can tell me. Is the lighting all right? Does it sound all right? Is this okay? Because this is gonna be the future. The future of Nick Zametti's shop. Um, I will take you around for a tour, but not today. Uh, I just wanna finish up by saying thanks to everyone for watching the channel and thanks and I do hope you like the project. I want to say a massive thank you also to today's sponsor Squarespace. Squarespace is an all-in-one platform to build a beautiful online presence and run your business. Basically Squarespace empowers millions of dreamers, makers and doers by providing them with the tools they need to bring their creative ideas to life. On Squarespace's dynamic, all-in-one platform, customers can actually claim a domain, build a website, and sell online. Happy days! And you can obviously market your brand on there as well. Their products combine cutting-edge design and world-class engineering, making it easier than ever to establish and own your online presence. These guys have award-winning customer service 24 seven. If you need these guys support, they do live chats. You can email them or you can actually attend one of their live webinars or check out their always available help guides. Not that you're gonna need that. If you've already got a domain, you can transfer it over to Squarespace. Easy peasy. Honestly, it's never been easier to sell your products online using Squarespace. So go on. Why not check out the links below? Head on over to squarespace.com. And when you're ready to launch, you can use my links, that's squarespace.com forward slash Nick and you'll get 10% off your first purchase. <laughs> Cheers, Squarespace. So please head on over and check these guys out. Find out what all the fuss is about. Don't forget to use my links. Plus, you'll be helping support me and my channel. Cheers, guys. So there it is, the final piece in my new shop. I really do hope you like this guys. It is only a small project but I wanted to do this for skateboards. We will do another skateboard project. I'm not too sure what yet. I have got a lot of the skateboard left over and I really am digging all these funky colours. They look so cool. Derek. Oh don't forget Make Essential coming up in about two weeks time. Probably about a week actually now depending upon when this video goes out. Grab your tickets, there's links below in the description as well for Makers Central. Come and see me and say hi. Got loads of things going on there and loads of other makers to meet. Right, I'll love you and leave you. Take care and I'll see you all soon.